In this video, we'll look at the area of a triangle. If you look at in section 3.2 in the formula booklet, you're given a new formula for the area of a triangle. It is, the area is equal to a half AB sine C. So let's have a look at how that is constructed. So you need A, B, and sine C. So what you actually need to use this is you need two sides and the angle between. So as long as you've got two sides and the angle between, you can find the area of a triangle. So let's find the area of this triangle. So we've got two sides of 6 and 7 centimetres with an angle between of 60 degrees. So we know that the area is equal to a half AB sine C. So the area is a half times 6 times 7 times sine 60. So A is a half times 6 times 7, which is 21, times root 3 over 2. So the area is 21 root 3 over 2 centimetres squared. And a second question, find the area of the triangle. Well, we've got a triangle with sides 8, 10, and 9 so we haven't got two sides and an angle in between but because we've got three sides we can use the cosine rule to find one of the angles so i'm going to find this angle here which i'm going to call theta so using the cosine rule i can say that cos theta is equal to b squared plus c squared minus a squared all over 2bc. So cos theta is equal to 10 squared plus 8 squared minus 9 squared over 2 times 10 times 8. So cos theta when you work that out, it comes to 0 0.51875. So theta is equal to cos to the minus 1, 0 0.51875. So theta is equal to 58.8 degrees. Now I've got the angle theta of 58.8 degrees. I could use the sine rule. So the area is equal to a half AB sine C. So the area is equal to a half times 8 times 10 times sine 58.8. So the area is equal to 40 times sine 58.8. So the area is equal to 34.2 centimetres squared.